to see where it goes. Might hurt. James Wade trying to keep his darts head on here amid all the mayhem around him. Yep, the crowd certainly getting involved now. They're getting late on, been here two, three hours. Getting well involved with the walk-ons and uh, all the players and the celebrities doing photographs 60. and autographs around the back. Steve Backley, the uh, only British track and field athlete to win medals at three different Olympics. Take quite some uh, performance to match that ever. 27. And tough as that with his cricket in background, playing with Raymond Barnevelt. So we've got the Barney Army and the Barney Army. Good. Well, we're going to have the ten to leave the double. But looking good in this first leg. Unless the flying Dutchman can start flying. Oh, he's got to fly from a long way back. And that 16. ain't going to do. Steve Uringwire, 52. 20 for double 16 or 12 for double top. Oh, he's Let's going for double, double one ball. Exhibition shot. Well, go on. You wouldn't, would you? Ah, he's got to go for it. No, he didn't do. Double 16. It would be a peculiar way round. Ah, 20. He wasn't even in the same parish. Oh, if that was Phil Tufnell, you would have called it a wide. Twenty-nine. Really needed to uh, weigh in heavily there, Phil. Thirty-two. But the pro needs double sixteen, and pros like double sixteen. James and James Wade, Wade has James Wade proved that calmly. To establish uh, a lead alongside the Olympian. Yeah, on. Pat on the back there from Steve, very pleased to get that first leg under the belt. Both determined to get to this final to play Razor Ruddick and Phil the Power Taylor. And I think the showbiz final would be uh, would be Ruddick and Tufnell. I don't think the programme is long enough for the walk-ons. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, if we ever got them on stage. Hey, that's good. 134. What a battle. Oh, he loved that one, didn't he? He's on! Hey, <laughs> big smile from Steve. He's on! He's coming, coming. I'm sure he won't mention that in the back room. Oh, Barney and Tuffers feeling the heat now. Because if the, uh, if the celeb starts to score heavy, and the uh, pro is anything like consistent, then that is a winning combination. Back-to-back oh, 1-3-4s. Back it's not often you see that. Anything you can do. 30. Just might be getting away from Tuffers, who uh, must have played a lot of darts in the old clubhouse and pavilion down the years while waiting to bat. Unless he's never batted for long. <laughs> Yeah, he actually played in that celebrity dancing uh, a few years ago, didn't he? And he actually won it. So I'm not sure about the opposition, how good they were. 91. That's good stuff to come down for treble 17. They're in charge here, Wade and Backley. Yes, certainly are. 171. Tuffers could be shouting, I'm a dark player, get me out of here. Just big numbers required now. Big numbers and soon. And it ain't 15. happening. Steve require 36. Uh, is it a 134 in this leg? No, he wants double 18. A little bit closer. 18. And overcompensated. Mm, disappointed with himself there, but. Wade coming back on the double to go 2 0 up. Barley needs to hit a big score here, and he looks like he's going to. Another one for 180. Just above. Yeah, gets them in touch. Puts a little bit of something on this double nine. Nice. Oh, well. Tufnell needs 99. Well, I think if he gets this, I've got a flake in it. <laughs> He didn't often get near 99 with the bat. The 
looking to leave something for his partner. Thinking the knowledge that it's the Salem who's going for nine now, so there's a chance that uh, Barnabal can come back. Yeah. No score. Oh, he's missed a single one. Well, this would be a steal. It oughtn't to have got this far. 18 for tops. 54. So Wade now back at the ball for nine to make amends for that three that miss at the double nine. That's a big one for double four for a 2 0 lead in this semi final. And the second second Sharp focus. And they are two thirds of the way there. Steve to throw first. A high five from Steve. Only one leg away from the final now. And throwing first. And throwing better than he has done all evening. Well done, Steve. Tell you what, he's getting the hang of this. Well, as I said before, all he wants to do is have his moment. He's had a 1 3 4 and a nice 100 there. 61. So he'll be absolutely over the moon with those two shots. They'll be even happier if they get to the final and win it. 100. Uh, Barney and Tuffers did knock out Webster and Tyndall, who'd been uh, many people's pre-competition favourites in the 16. previous round. But they haven't refound that form now. Yeah, just so difficult to pick a favourite, isn't it, when it's uh, something like this? It's, a lot of the games have gone down to the double, down to the wire. And it's nice to see some of the celebrities yeah, hitting the doubles. With Razor hitting the double top earlier on in the first round. For a double two. And that magical 160 by Tubbers, but he can't find that form in this semi final. Well, if Wade scores heavily now, then uh, he and Steve Backley are in touch. One within touch of the final. Uh, a long way ahead, 2 0 ahead, and over 200 ahead. He's got to get close enough. He's got to get close Steve enough. And he hasn't. So uh, Backley is at the hockey now in the knowledge that Wade will have a go at doubles later if necessary. Perhaps it won't come to that. Perhaps there's the miracle. Not well, this time. I would love to see him hit it. But he knows that his partner's going to come back on 62. So he's going to have at least one down at that double. That second out went over the side screen. Danger requires 62. This to win it. 48 left. So they're down for the 16s. Double top. Double top for it. No. 42. No. But still no check out for uh, Raymond van Barneveld. But of course it will be Backley going for the uh, double when he returns. Yeah, the butterflies will be in his stomach now. He'd be wanting to hit this for his partner. Three downs at the double ten. The man who's thrown a javelin further than anyone in the world. Double seven required now. Oh, that is close. And that is close, but neither close enough. Both on the wire, very unlucky there. Tough goal, one four eight, won't happen. Oh, I think he needs a head job, doesn't he? Ah. Ah. Thirteen. Oh, that's what they call muck spreading, Peter. <laughs> Double seven for it. That's three he's had at it. Or they have. Game Fourth shot. one's good enough. And the match, and Wade without response, Wade and Backley have taken three legs on the spin. And the spinner is out. Tuffle and Van Barneveld have gone. It's going to be Wade and Backley against Taylor and Rudder in the Pro Select final.